The Creature from Jekyll Island is a book written by G. Edward Griffin that explores the history of the Federal Reserve System and the events that led to its creation. The book is divided into four parts and covers a wide range of topics related to the Federal Reserve, including its history, its role in the economy, and its impact on society. Part 1 of the book provides an overview of the history of money and banking in the United States. Griffin describes the origins of banking in the United States and how it evolved over time. He also discusses the various monetary systems that have been used throughout history and the problems associated with each one. Part 2 of the book focuses on the creation of the Federal Reserve. Griffin describes how a group of powerful bankers, including J.P. Morgan, met on Jekyll Island off the coast of Georgia in 1910 to discuss the creation of a central banking system. He explains how these bankers were able to convince Congress to pass the Federal Reserve Act in 1913 and how the Federal Reserve has operated since then. Part 3 of the book examines the role of the Federal Reserve in the economy. Griffin argues that the Federal Reserve is responsible for many of the economic problems that the United States has faced over the years including inflation, recessions, and financial crises. He also discusses the ways in which the Federal Reserve has manipulated the money supply to achieve its goals. Part 4 of the book looks at the future of the Federal Reserve and the potential consequences of its actions. Griffin argues that the Federal Reserve is a dangerous institution that has far too much power and influence over the economy. He also suggests that the only way to truly reform the Federal Reserve is to abolish it altogether and return to a system of sound money. Overall, The Creature from Jekyll Island is a well-researched and highly informative book that provides a detailed history of the Federal Reserve System and its impact on the United States. Griffin's arguments are compelling and thought-provoking, and the book is a must-read for anyone who is interested in understanding the role of the Federal Reserve in the economy.